Did Robert Downey Jr.'s home spearhead the way buildings are constructed in the near future? Robert Downey Jr. owns some weird real estate, which for somebody worth over $300 million as of the last report, I guess no big deal. He can own whatever he wants. Being ranked as the highest paid actor in the whole Marvel franchise sure has its perks. And just like Tony Stark, Robert Downey Jr. has his unique way of splashing that money by buying a bunch of multi-million dollar properties. It doesn't get much more cozy in this joint. He has a ranch style home home in the Palisades, a $5.6 million house in Venice Beach, and he even has a home built around a windmill in the Hamptons. A 9.4 million pound mansion began as a playhouse before it was transformed into a full-fledged residence. Although it was never actually a functioning windmill, it's certainly on the quirky side. The property also includes a 50-foot pool and a tennis court. But his most prized possession yet is his 13.5 estate in Malibu, which interesting enough, shares the same zip code as his mansion in Iron Man. Let's just hope that this one doesn't blow up like in the movie. Here's my home address. 10 880 Malibu Point, 90265. I'll leave the door unlocked. This beautiful homestead has a main house that was built in the 70s, which has three bedrooms and four bathrooms. Plus, they also have their own sort of petting zoo containing a bunch of animals, from alpacas to goats and pigs. But the real star of the show was his latest creation found on the other side of the lot. I don't know how I didn't know about this home sooner, but what you're looking at is Robert Downey Jr.'s bungalow in Malibu. Aside from the two-story house, the seven-acre Malibu estate also has a futuristic-looking guest house unlike anything you have seen before. At first glance, the three-headed turtle shell exterior can easily be mistaken for a hobbit hut or the house in Teletubbies. But don't be fooled by its weird dome image because the interior is just as cool as exterior. Gorgeous. The windows? Cute. Looks like a little egg. Very fun. It looks so large. Honestly, I just want to like touch the walls. Although the whole house has an odd shape with curved windows and curved walls, the designers still did an awesome job maximizing the space. Pretty much every furniture is custom made just like their dining table with a unique shape, their bubble sofa with mushroom lamps, and this hanging nest in the playroom adds to the home's already eccentric vibe. But what's really captivating about this house is its construction, because building it requires the use of inflatable materials. Not to mention that the process to form it was also sustainable. First, the beanie shells are inflated, shaping the form of a house. Then everything is covered with rebar. Next, a layer of concrete is sprayed over the entire balloon. And the result, a sturdy and innovative building using minimum materials with great insulation and durability. The technology used in RDJ's home is called Binichols, which claims to cut down construction costs and at the same time does minimal harm to the environment. RDJ and his wife are huge advocates of a more sustainable world. That's why the Binichell concept was perfect for them. We want to revolutionize construction from a cost perspective, from an environmental perspective, and from a structural perspective. On top of that, they also installed wind turbines and solar panels in their property to cut their carbon footprint. With the growing awareness for more eco-friendly options today, it's good to know that influential people such as Robert are setting a good example for the rest of us.